We are at the Mauna Kea Visitor Centre. We are very, very high up at the moment. Uh, there, through the fog, you can see the top of the mountain and it's a very, very steep ascent. Um, it's been steep coming up here, 30 miles an hour, foot flat on the floor, and uh, we're above the, the, the clouds. The, the clouds are lower than us at the moment. Uh, some of them are a bit higher over there. You can see that from here, the mound, and uh, some parking spaces here. So we're just going to go in, check out the weather conditions, and uh, uh, see what's going on. It's pretty chilly up here. Uh, it's dropped down to below 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, can't convert that back to centigrade at the moment. But. Uh, Lots of Japanese tourists over here and lots of um, these uh, tour groups gathering up, acclimatising themselves, getting some hot tea down them. Very cool up here. Ah, Mauna Kea Visitor Centre. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's this? Oh, is that a volcano? Lovely. The reason why it's a weird colour in here is because uh, all the lights are red. Hawaiians were losing touch with Mauna Kea and with their culture. Many of the old people would speak with tell us that as children growing up in the 1920s and 30s, they were punished for speaking the language. And have gone through many things because their landscape is a very I really wish I had been going away. Where else?